I'll be fine. I'll be fine. It's not even been a week. Th that still counts. Sorta. Ugh. Five days after Valentine's is close enough anyways. I've got this. I'll be fine. Just... Just... Ring the stupid doorbell, Vi. You've got this. Okay. Nope, nope, nope. Can't do it. Can't... <clears throat> uh, s screw it. Screw it. Hey there. Sorry, I... I know I'm late. We promised to meet at 7, and it's... It's almost 8, but... I got caught up in something. Well, my mom kept asking me stupid questions, because we got a new computer recently, and we really shouldn't have gotten one. <laughs> no, my mom's alright with technology, just she has trouble adapting. Sorry, I'm already rambling. Can I come in? Thanks. Now that I think about it, it's been a while since I've come to your place, hasn't it? Well, I mean, I just stepped foot in, and I can already see a few things different. For example, allow me to enlighten you that I notice all the stupid details. The stuff that is on that cabinet right there is different. I can also see that there are a few kitchen appliances that aren't there. I think your blender is missing, isn't it? <laughs> Come on, don't give me that look. Fine, fine, I'm weird, whatever. Whatever suits you, I guess. <laughs> but really, it has been quite a while since we hung out last, hasn't it? I mean, we were both busy with exams, so of course we wouldn't see each other that often, and we still called every now and then, but... Ugh, this sounds very stupid, but it's not the same. <laughs> as cliche as that is, it's true. You're telling me you get the same satisfaction from calling me every day as you do when we have game nights with pizza and all the unhealthy soda you can ever imagine? Okay, well, you're just a liar then. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. I guess that's enough for some people, but not for me. I just want to see you in person, I guess. It, it's comforting. Fine, fine, make fun of me all you want, mushy stuff's over. Come here and at least get, let me give you a hug. <laughs> I missed you. So, anyways, what does my favorite nerd in all the world have planned for a impromptu game night? Oh please, I know you decided on this last minute. Well, I recall you having a dinner planned with your parents. Guess that didn't go through. Yeah, yeah, I suck for remembering shit, whatever. <laughs> Seriously though, what do you want to do? Ah yes, the tried and true tactic of playing video games. Truly mankind's favorite. <laughs> Alright, fine, I'll stop bugging you. But sure, what game do you want to play? There is that one game we started and never beat because exams were around the corner. I can't remember the name of it though. Right, it takes two, that was it. God, I kind of missed that game to be honest. I thought about it here and there during the exams. I know, I know, we didn't play it a whole lot, but the first stage was pretty fun and I like the co-op. What can I say? Games are always fun with more people. Especially when those people are you. I swear to god, I am going to commit a felony if we lose this stage one more time because of you. Okay, now, how is it my fault that you can't get over a two feet gap? Right, right, shift the blame all you want. I know deep in my heart, it really is you who sucks at video games. 
And cue that again. Great. <laughs> so, how were your exams? Yes, yes, I get it. Nobody wants to talk about that. But seriously, how were they? This was the first time I wasn't there to tutor you. Well, as long as you think they went okay. I'm sure you did your best, so hey, that's fine. Oh, right. There was also something I wanted to ask you, actually. Well, I noticed that we have been texting every day, and mostly you've been pretty respondent, but... I noticed there was one particular day that you didn't respond. I'm sure you can figure it out from that, but that day was... I don't know, five days ago? Something like that. You know damn well what I'm going to ask you next. <laughs> oh, yes, this is totally happening. So... Did my sweet little best friend finally get herself a boyfriend? <laughs> hey, I had to, come on. I never get to tease you like this. It's a serious question, though. Did you have a Valentine's Day date? No. Huh. Then, if you don't mind, why weren't you responding on that day? You were busy. Oh my god, right. Ugh, your dad was moving, wasn't he? Yeah, no, that definitely makes sense why you wouldn't... Why you wouldn't text me? <laughs> um, can we like pretend like I didn't just ask you that? B because it, it's kind of stupid, and I don't know. I was teasing you, and 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 I was asking if you had a date because because I got. <sighs> I got jealous. There. Happy now? Yes, okay, yes. I got jealous. I imagined you hanging out with a date and having a good time and getting a boyfriend and... And stupid old me had to get jealous. Is that what you wanted to hear? <sighs> yes, I get... I should be happy for you. I totally get that. Even if you didn't get a boyfriend, or it didn't work out, I should be happy that you went on a date, or something along those lines, but... <sighs> you really are gonna make me say it, aren't you? Fine, okay, yes. I... I love you. You're my best friend, and you've been just my best friend for years, and... I don't know, you're the first one who actually makes me feel cared about, like... Like, they want me to be happy, and I want you to be happy as well, and I want you in my life, okay? You've made me so incredibly happy these past few years, and I don't want to lose you. Not now, not in a decade, not ever. So, I'll say it again, but I love you, okay? And I hope that you can just forget that this night ever happened, and we can go- <laughs> That's... That's not a fun joke, you know? Playing... Playing with people's feelings like that, and... <laughs> okay, fine. I get it. So, wait... Take it, you like me too, then? <laughs> I love you. I love you so, so, so much. And I know that I'm five days late, but you were busy on Valentine's, so that gives me a reason, so... I'll say it again. I really love you, and I want you to be my belated Valentine. As well as the year after, and the year after, 
and so on and so forth. <laughs> yeah, I love you too.